Hello everyone, are you ready for another fucking adventure? We're here talking about Paradox, the villain for the, um... The villain from Jaden Yuki and his amazing sidekicks? Yes, exactly. I like the your The best spawn. Yu-Gi-Oh movie. Why, because it has Jaden in it? Because Jaden is the greatest thing ever, yeah. Has there ever been a GX movie? No. Really? I think all of the movie movies are only, uh, at least involve the base Yu-Gi-Oh universe. I don't think any of them have, like, a feature film that does not involve Yugi. Because when they could have done it, they ended up making Dark Side of Dimensions instead. <laughs> I guess they picked uh, what they thought would be the winner. Sparks. Wow, 50 life point damage. Get fucked. Sparks. Eat it. Our dancing elf will go face down in defense mode. It doesn't even matter if you know what it is or not. Because you're going to lose to it. Damn it. No. Nope. I forgot that I needed to go heal my life point damage. So I'm still at a uh, cool. Oh, no. I should. No, no, I can't beat it. No, the Furious C can beat it. Get him, Furious C. Look how angry he is. He looks like if Knuckles he's took him. He's irate. So he looks like he just saw that Tatsuna Sudashugu thing swing by. <laughs> And now he, oh, we got fucking taken down by our own dude by the Lale Lule Lo. No, not Lale Lule Lo Loon. I love him. Why would, why is everyone just coming out to betray us? He's our friend. I can't believe he would do this. If someone has wood remains, I'm going to be pissed off. Like, how dare they? At this point, we know that Reshif is out to actually get us if they're using, like, all, all our dudes I from. Know. How dare he do this to us? Such a punk ass move. I mean, I guess I'll just put down Mechanical Spider. Our new ace in the hole, Mechanical Spider. <laughs> yeah, getting a getting a good showdown here. He kind of looks like Area Dose if he got a little chunky. Yeah. And like it was a fat baby version. Yeah, fat baby version. Like if Spinda let itself go. <laughs> uh, we should be able. So I'm pretty Dumbus sure take Spinda it is the teddy bear. Why, why? Even for a tribute, this the cursor is the craziest thing in the world. Yeah, dude, I'm telling you, it does it for everything. Every action that you take on the board makes the fucking cursor do that. I'm just trying to think. Is it is it because the AI is literally thinking at such a level? They're just like, uh, all right. The AI has to calculate its next move. It sure feels that way. Maybe that's the the reason why Yu-Gi-Oh never ever got smarter AI is because this is <laughs> the this is the peak. Exactly. We've peaked Yu-Gi-Oh! AI. It's because they're like, well, if, in order for it to be as strong as we want it, it has to keep doing this kind of shit. Alright, let's see. Yeah, Morphin Jar 2 will get it done. Right? No, I was really hoping they'd be real funny if I lost Morphin Jar number 2 right away. <laughs> uh, you and I have different versions of the word funny. Yeah, funny for me is usually I get fucked over in some way. Why, Trollbird, I hate looking at you. <laughs> you look like a giant dumbass. He does, though. He does. Look at this dumbass bird. <laughs> what a droll-ass bird. Droll-ass bird. Now, it's, now he's getting beaten down by the very weather itself. Man, who knew that stand from part 6 was a shitty Yu-Gi-Oh card? That's actually the secret to a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh cards, is that they're just a lot of shitty Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Goodbye, monster on the field, <laughs> and now... Oh yes, our favorite monster coming in. Oh yeah, it's <laughs> it's, it's, our, it's this thing. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that tongue. It didn't even finish the fucking monster off, what was the point of summoning him? <laughs> Oh, nice. Our deck capacity increased by three. Thank Christ. Wow. We can add literally nothing into our deck. Yeah, it's nothing. I'm saving my real strategies for the tournament. Yeah, whatever, dude. Whatever, bro. You don't have a character portrait, so you're irrelevant. Exactly. You're not like... Well, I was going to say I don't have it right now either, but... Are, you, are we going to do this? Are you not going to let me go by... Duel him. Oh, oh fuck! I forgot to. God damn it! I forgot to. I forgot to increase my life points. Oh shit! 
Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Train's moving, bro. Okay. No. <laughs> <laughs> this is so unfair. <laughs> I forgot. I don't think you can restore your life points on here. If you can, I don't know how. I don't think you can. It's the Alm's turn. Okay. We're gonna have to be very smart and play Ancient Jar. Serve his life points. Watch him play something with like 1,400 attack. Eat Igaboon. Take that, bewitching Thandom Thief. As I tried to pronounce that and then immediately <laughs> failed. Get him, Phantom D1. First Ancient Jar is gonna see if there's a trap card. There isn't. I have to remember that I'm automatically at a deficit. So, that'll be fun. Oh, no, man. the Melting Red Shadow. That's another one of our old dudes. It's a, it's a cacophony of just former friends turning against us. <laughs> Life is pain. Exactly. I'm glad you see it the same way I do. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing is, is that I really do think like the uh, we're not going to have that much of a hard time until we run into that guy with an actual portrait. In which case, I will then probably lose Jinzo number 7, and then we'll figure out what to do from there. Yeah. Obviously, we have to go with Buku. Yeah, Buku. Obviously. Clearly. Buku. Buku, fucking destroy this guy. Fuck him up, Buku. Show him what it looks like. When we show him, like, other books to read. <laughs> Here's an excerpt from... Ah, oh, no! <laughs> Morphe Jar Buku, can't read. no! <laughs> Damn it. I really liked Buku. Now I'm gonna summon this dumbass Droll Bird. I think he actually has type advantage, so he's just gonna win. Duh. <laughs> Droll this Bird. Is going Droll great. Bird. Droll Bird would have celebrated even if he died. Yeah, Droll Bird would be on the ground bleeding out and being like, yay! Droll, Droll Bird do good. <laughs> Droll Bird don't breathe. Droll, Droll Bird do it, yay! Oh, drill board go lie on floor. <laughs> Let's see how much does Drillbird this guy have. Drillbird getting dark. Drillbird feeling life essence <laughs> leave self. <laughs> Drillbird so cold. <laughs> Drillbird wish to tell family the truth. <laughs> tell Drillbird's mother. Drillbird loves her. Tell Drillbird's <laughs> father. To blast, blast my cash. <laughs> delete my internet history. De delete Droll Bird's internet history. <laughs> and then when you look at it, all it says is that he looked up <laughs> recipes for cakes. <laughs> there were birthday cakes for his mom. That's why he didn't want her to see. He didn't want to ruin the surprise even though he's fucking dead. Now she'll know. Even after... <laughs> Now she has a dead son and a ruined party. <laughs> Dr Drillbird did his best. And still, Drillbird fails. Drillbird did his best. Drillbird go down with a smile on his face. <laughs> oh, we got Meteor Dragon. All right. Finally, some okay shit. Yeah, that's a card that I would put in the deck. You're a lot tougher than you look. Damn right. Fight me. You'll be my first win. <laughs> Avenge Drollbird. <laughs> Avenge Drollbird. Drollbird, we're starting the game over again. <laughs> Drollbird live? <laughs> Drollbird have power you didn't over put death. Meteor Dragon in the deck. I did not put Meteor Dragon in the deck because I was too busy fucking thinking of Drollbird. <laughs> and then we got him again. <laughs> hmm. He literally Jin just looks like he's going like, ah, all ah. the time. Not also, in the wood remains cool guy way, but in an actual he's screaming way. So instead of going, ah, he's going, mm. Yeah, yeah. Drillbird. <laughs> 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 Drillbird Dril Dril thinks it's a good idea to play Final Destiny. <laughs> Drillbird is like, oh, you drew Final Destiny, bro, play it. He's bro, like, play it. He's like, for Jaden, but he's gives really shitty advice. God damn it, and then we. <laughs> Starboy, why? Oh no. Oh, this is all bad. 
You know what that I means. I think Final Destiny. <laughs> First of all, Drolber ready to fight. Now Drolber will meet his maker. <laughs> Drolbird's doing the Majin Vegeta sacrifice right now. This is for everyone. For <laughs> This is for you, Buku, and even you, uh, poor s fish thing. <laughs> Disgusting horse fish monster. Ah, damn it! <laughs> no, Buku! <laughs> I was hoping for Genin! <laughs> Me too. Genin or was the, the only card. Ah, oh, this is all this bad. This is not gonna go well, I don't think. No. <laughs> you mean the, the, the Majin Vegeta sacrifice didn't work? Weird. Oh, no. Oh, weird. I hope you saved, because I'm pretty sure if you lose, it's just game over. Is it? I think so. Well, that happens. This is going to be the final part of <laughs> the <laughs> Rush of Destruction. I warned you about this game. I didn't know that it would be this bad. Look, if there's one thing that's good that's come out of this, it's Drollbird. <laughs> Drollbird is the one. I do like Drollbird. He's grown on me. Dro you know, Drollbird might be the only thing that... And Wicked Mirror, because he always shows up <laughs> too late. <laughs> Alright, now let's see if I actually legitimately lose everything. And if this is the end of... The Why am I... Why do you suck? It's almost as if all his cards were... <laughs> Taken away in some Majin Vegeta like sacrifice. <laughs> weird. Really, really weird. I like to think that Majin Drollbird acts exactly the same. <laughs> Nothing changes about him. <laughs> he's just got the M on his forehead. He's like, ah. <laughs> ah. <sighs> Alright, so we're good. The only thing that happened is that we lost Jinzo number seven. So it's just this guy. Yep, but we're back at the start, and here's the thing. I don't know how to beat that guy, because he doesn't have a theme to his deck. Yeah, there's not like a thing you can copy. No, there really isn't. Um, Man, is the answer to this just we're going to grind it out and then... I don't know. I mean, we can try again. Yeah, we'll try again. But we'll try again in another episode. Bye, Cause... guys. Bye, guys. This game is really fun. It is the funnest game in the world. I really like this game, guys. It's really great. I totally don't hate it. I totally don't hate every second about it, except for when Troll I'm totally not fucking miserable that we're back at Domino City again. <laughs> Already. Actually, you know what? Let's, let's look and remember. <laughs> well, actually, no, wait. That might actually be the next best thing about it, is that these guys can get stuck behind <laughs> this pillar. <laughs> I like how Ishizu is over there like... Did, did you lose already? <laughs> shh, shh. Guys, I'm gonna need a minute alone with my wife. Can you please? <laughs> Can you please stop Can you please? switching spots behind me? Can you stop zigzagging around behind my back, please? I just need, I just need you to... Uh, so... Are you guys gonna be... Okay, one moment. Okay, you guys are gonna fucking act like this? <laughs> it reminds <laughs> me of, like, a, an old anime where a character will turn around and the other guy will quickly spin around behind his back. <laughs> it's 100% like that. Alright, everyone. See you later.